While using the 80-20 rule, did you know that 20% of your buyers bring in the majority of your sales? Now that's not to say that all of your buyers are not important, but that 20% of your buyers are what we call your serious premium buyers. Did you know that most sales funnels are set up to combine your premium buyers and your non-premium buyers together into one big list? Now, if you think about that impact of this common mistake, which is combining your premium buyers and your other buyers into one big list, what happens is the results show themselves in low engagement, low interaction, and low retention rate of buyers. So you basically what you want to do is you want to segment the two of them. And that's what this is all about. So if you'd like to know how to set up your sales funnel to achieve this goal in finding your diamond in the rough buyers so that when you promote to them, your conversion rates are going to be a lot higher and more responsive, then we're going to show you a smart sales funnel blueprint that's going to show you how to find your premium buyers so that you can focus on scaling your business. So that's actually one of the easiest ways to scale your business. So just a quick, quick videos overview here. Video number one is going to be the introduction to smart sales funnels. Number two, we're going to talk about the typical funnel that everybody tends to use. So you're aware of what that funnel looks like so that you don't follow the crowd, right? And then we're going to talk about common mistakes so that you know what to avoid doing. And then after that, we'll talk about what you should do. We'll talk about smart OTO one time offers 2.0, basically how to set up your one time offers in such a way that you can segment your premium buyers versus your regular buyers. And then we'll talk about technology roadblock because that's always the roadblock. And I'm going to show you exactly what tools to use, what software tools that you can use to speed up the whole process of allowing you to segment your premium buyers versus your regular buyers, because you're going to need some technology to do that other than, you know, you going out and trying to find a coder to do that for you. It's just easier to use something that's already pre-made just for that purpose. And then of course, we're going to talk about in video number seven, how to set up your smart OTO 2.0. So I'm going to show you step by step exactly what to do. And then of course, in video number eight, we're going to show you how to integrate this into WordPress. And I'm going to give you a free WordPress plugin that you can use that will run with the software that I'm going to talk about in video number six. So if you stay tuned till the end, you'll get to download that free plugin. All right. So video number nine is going to be profit checkout bumps, basically. How can you double or quadruple or even triple your profits at your checkout page? So this is kind of like an added bonus. All right. So with this video course, you can discover how to create higher converting lists by finding your premium buyers. So go ahead and grab this video course and we'll see you on the other side.